All right, welcome back, Hustle Gang. It's yours truly, Hustling Jules. If you guys are new here, I cover anything from my interests, my hobbies, and whatever I'm currently into. So if you guys like what you see, go ahead and like, comment, subscribe. Go ahead and view the description box. Go ahead and see uh, a link to my Patreon and my PayPal if you guys will go ahead and like to uh, support this channel a little bit further. So today we're going to be talking about where's all the ammo? Where has it gone? How do you get more of it? What are some tips and tricks to get some? So let's go ahead and dive right into it. All right, so let's go yeah. ahead and start off and say, where's the ammo? There's very few in stores. It's hard to get online. How do you get your hands on it? How do you get some ammo to load it up and take it shooting? All right, so if you're going to go in stores, you have to know exactly when the, the shipment is coming. You have to be first in line and not just when the doors open at 9 o'clock or 8 o'clock, wherever the time it is it opens up. You got to be at least two hours early. So you have to go ahead and have the time and dedication and also you got to be a little smart, be a little strategic so you can get there first before anybody, play a little bit of the waiting game and make sure you secure that ammo. Because uh, when shipment comes in, they might not have a whole lot, you know, it might be very few on hands. I heard of some stores of like, um, they're having the ammo because it's so short, they're having it by customer service instead of it putting it on the shelf. Like it's going by that quickly and or you can only buy like two, one or two boxes, maybe three if you're lucky. So that's one way. The second way is you got to be religiously online continuously online checking like like it like it's a job like this is your hobby this is what you use to protect yourself uh this is something that you love you have to go ahead and put the time and dedication to make sure you you, you find that ammo now there's a couple websites i use that you guys probably use already you guys probably even know better websites but i'm going to let you guys know so um on these websites what i definitely recommend is go ahead and make an account Make an account so you can go in and just log in very quickly. Have your credit card information or your PayPal or however you want to pay for your stuff. Have it on standby because when, when it comes on, when the shipments come in and the notifications, people get notifications that ammo is in, they're buying it ASAP. They're buying ASAP. So no time, don't waste time on trying to log in, typing your credit card stuff down. Like, no, grab how many you want in your cart and just purchase it. Just go ahead and do it. Don't think about it. Don't even shop around for pricing. Like pricing, guess it's a little bit higher right now. Yes, because of everything going on, supply and demand. It's a little fucked up, yes, but uh, it's just it's just what's going on. So if you see the ammo, it's something that you shoot. It's a, it's a website that you normally trust. Go ahead, put it in your cart, buy it. But let's back up a little bit. Let's try to go ahead and understand why there's such an ammo shortage. We got multiple things going on that's just like a domino effect, a big snowball effect that's just making it super hard and difficult to get the ammo. First that comes to mind is we have social unrest. We're having, uh, you know, riots. We're having looters. We're having all that stuff. And with that going on, people are feeling unsafe and they want to go to protect themselves, which is leading to new gun owners. And when you buy guns, you need ammo. So there's that one. The second one is now the coof going on. So if the coof going on, you know, and, and government's overreaching, telling you what you can and can't do. People are not starting to trust the government at all. So now they're going ahead and protecting themselves, getting the, they're getting, getting firearms, learning how to shoot, X, Y, and Z. So that's the second one. In combination to one and two, it, uh, it's also um, a whole lot of new gun owners. You know, all these new gun owners, we're having month after month of, of, of skyrocketed record number sales of new gun owners like I don't even know the statistics maybe I'll put it up for you guys or you guys probably already know this stuff so I want to make this I want to make this video very simple and then the last but not least um, that everyone everyone has experienced and is it's going through right now is gonna be it's a new presidential election cycle and with that going on you have to see what the candidates how they stand when it comes to the Second Amendment if they're pro 2A or not or what policies that they're trying to put into place so with all those three things going on People are buying ammo like crazy, like crazy, no joke. And you already have your guys that buy ammo in bulk. They probably know somebody at the store and they always hold them ammo or they come there, they buy by five or buy by 10. You know, it's, it's always something like that. So um, it's just supply and demand now that so many people are applying for licenses or, or getting new firearms and they have to get the ammo. It's just, and it's hard to get ammo. Now they're buying more ammo than, than they need. Some, most of the times, people would just buy a couple boxes that you used to shoot, maybe buy one or two to save, and build the, the, the little collection there, you know, a uh, little reserve. Now, everyone's just buying ammo when you see it, and I won't even lie, like, when I see ammo online, I just buy it. I don't even think about it, you know, and, and I suggest the same thing for you guys. It might be a little bit pricey, don't spend a whole lot more, a little bit more, and, and, and kind of stay within your budget. You know, if you see the ammo and it's not going to hurt you financially, buy the ammo, just buy it. And and if, if you go to the stores, man, don't be don't be a dick. 
You know what I mean? Don't buy all the ammo if you can. Leave some, leave some ammo for the guy behind you, especially if you have like a couple thousand rounds at home that you're not going to catch up to. Yeah, leave that guy some ammo. And also, uh, in addition to the whole KUF-19 going on, we have, we have different way of living now. Like, it's slowing down production unequivocally. Like, it's, it's slowed down to the max. They can't have that many people because they have to be six feet. They don't have, you know, that many machines going on. It's, it's making it hard to go in and get the raw materials like brass, copper, lead, uh, gunpowder. Everything's been slowed down. Then there's even, like, the truck, the truck drivers. Uh, because they don't feel as safe traveling through the states. Some They're not going to certain states. So I, I know that the truck industry has been impacted by the KUF as well. And if the trucks are being impacted, your ammo's not getting to the store. Which is causing you not to be able to buy it. It's causing you even a bigger shortage. So that is definitely another big factor. There's just so many things adding up here that just makes it so hard to get ammo. Which is why I say if you do see it, buy it. Now let's go ahead and talk about what are those websites that you can go ahead and buy the ammo from. Okay, now for the websites to buy ammo, I've personally been buying everything right now in the past couple, two, three months. I've been buying everything directly from, from SigSour.com and, and Federal Ammunitions. So I use them, and of course, like I said, I have an account with them, I have my credit card information signed up, so it's easy and quick. Also, if you guys like other websites like Brownells, Academy, Outdoor Unlimited, uh, you know, all, all those other ones, you know, Cabela's, whatever. Um, Get sign up for the notifications. If you see an ammo that you need to buy or, or a gun or a firearm, whatever that you need to get, sign up and get the notifications. You get the notifications by making an account and they just email you. It's not the best way, uh, but maybe if you're lucky, you can check your email when it come when it comes to you and they haven't been sold out yet. And that's another way to, to take an advantage. The next best way, this is probably better than going directly um, from those other websites, but I definitely have been having good luck with SIG and Federal directly on their website. But again, check religiously. It's like a job. If you need ammo. You need to put in the time. So I've been going to Wiki Arms and also what's it, what is it called? Bulk BulkCheapAmmo.com. Use those two. Uh, it's pretty much a big search engine that tells you who has ammo, what's the deals, and you can type in exactly what you're looking for. It might not be you know oh, I only need 100 rounds or 200 rounds for the weekend, and there might be a deal to get 500 rounds or a thousand rounds, and you have to come out of pocket a little bit more. But hey, it's hard to get ammo, and if you're not going to be hurt financially. Buy it in bulk. That's always been the best way. You know that. Buy your ammo in bulk. All right, guys. I'm going to wrap up this video. If you made it to the end, I want to say thank you guys so much. Odegato gozaimasu. Appreciate you taking time at the end of your day to go ahead and join it with me to learn a little bit about what's going on, how to get your ammo. So if you guys like what you saw, like, comment, subscribe. Definitely helps out the channel. Don't forget to check the description box to go ahead and see uh, a link directly to my PayPal or my Patreon. We can greatly support this channel and we go ahead and produce more content for you. So keep it locked, keep it loaded. I'm your boy Hustle Jewels. Yeah, hustle never sleeps, baby.